Beliefs are a really powerful tool that can change the way that you look at the world and how you move through it. With the right set of beliefs, you can create a roadmap for yourself that leads straight to success. But in order to have the life you want, you need to build a set of powerful, positive beliefs. Unfortunately, not everyone is born with these beliefs. We all hold some negative or limiting beliefs in our mind. And in order to build the belief system that will bring you the life of your dreams, you may have to change or adapt your beliefs. Now, this process is not easy, but it can be done. How? The answer lies in a little acronym I came up with called CAFI. In this video, we'll briefly touch on CAFI and how you can use this system to create a set of productive, positive beliefs for yourself. So the first letter of CAFI is C, which stands for clarity. What do you believe? What are your goals? If you could draw a roadmap of your life, would you be able to? And can you answer all these questions in just one sentence? This may seem like an impossible task. How can you list the things you want in your life in just one sentence? It's possible, and it requires a lot of self-reflection, but defining concise and clear goals is an extremely important process. Humans are goal-pursuing machines, so you need to give your brain a clear goal to pursue. If you're trying to get rid of a limiting belief, you can't just get rid of it. You have to give it something else to replace it with, something to strive for. But how do you get started on this process? Clarifying your beliefs and your vision may require sitting down and asking yourself some questions. Ask yourself about your goals, write them down, how you think you can achieve those goals, and what makes you the right person to achieve your goals. Try to limit your answers to just one sentence, a paragraph at most. This might require prioritizing your goals or letting go of some distracting beliefs and projects. Cleaning out your closet of distractions will only help you reaffirm the beliefs that do stick and help you move forward on one single path. I actually have an entire video about your vision, so I'll talk a little bit more about it later. These single sentences can change your entire life, so don't rush through the process. Some of them take years to formulate. Take some time to create clear affirmations and beliefs that will stick with you throughout your journey. Secondly, we have affirmations. Let's talk about affirmations for a moment. They are very similar to beliefs, but structured in a way that you can repeat them and use them as motivation throughout your journey. Once you have clarified your beliefs and your goals, it's time to transform those beliefs and goals into affirmations. So don't worry if you're not 100% confident or you still feel a little bit shaky about where your goals are. Affirmations can help you manifest your goals quicker and truly hold on to those beliefs that you want. How? Well, affirmations are created to be repeated over and over, day in and day out. The more you tell yourself something, the more likely you will start to believe that it to be true. Just like the more likely someone tells you a story that has never happened in your life, the more likely you'll start to believe that false memory. See, there's a thing in psychology called cognitive dissonance, and it means that what you're thinking and what you're doing are not aligned with each other. Your brain hates cognitive dissonance. In fact, some psychologists say it's the cause of all anxiety. So your brain tries really hard to get rid of either the behavior or the thinking, whichever one is easier. And by thinking something over and over and over again, using an affirmation, you hope that instead of your belief changing, you change your behavior until it aligns with the affirmation. So, if you say you want to help the environment, but you drive a gas guzzler, some psychologists believe this creates a hidden anxiety until either your belief or your action changes. The idea is that either your belief will change or your actions will. Well, with affirmations like I said earlier, you keep repeating them until your subconscious mind gets the message and you change your behavior to align. So first, when you start repeating I am confident and people love to be around me in the mirror, you're going to feel a little awkward and it's because of the anxiety from cognitive dissonance. But over time, you will come to believe your affirmations until you completely embody them. Your beliefs will change and then your behavior will change. They are the best tool to help you change and truly take on new beliefs. Most people just do them wrong. The third letter of CAFI is F, which stands for facts. I understand that clarifying and embodying an entirely new set of beliefs is no easy feat. After all, you probably believe the limiting beliefs that are holding you back. Abandoning your old beliefs, even in the name of creating a better life for yourself, is a hard process. And this is where the F of CAFI comes in. Beliefs are very different from facts. It's actually quite easy to believe a fact, but not all beliefs are based in facts. And you can use this idea to break down negative beliefs that are holding you back. Here's just one example. Let's say you're 30 years old and you have the limiting belief that you're too old to start working towards your dreams. This isn't a fact. This is just a belief. Where are the facts that you can pull from this limiting belief? Well, one is your age. You are 30 years old. Isolate this fact from your limiting belief. Does it have anything to do with your ability to pursue your dreams? It really doesn't. Associating your age with ability or the right time to pursue your beliefs is just based in opinion. It's not true. You can flip this belief around and say, I am 30 and I am at the right age to start working towards my dream. I have the right mixture of enthusiasm and experience. 
No one can tell you that you're lying. The facts within your belief have not changed, just the way that you associate those facts with your goals. The company Geico was created by a 50-year-old man, KFC was created by someone who was 62, and Ray Kroc started McDonald's when he was 52 years old. These are all facts. Now this process may seem silly, or even useless, but this is because your belief system is very strong. Don't worry about being silly as you break down your negative beliefs, and start to build positive ones. Focus on objectively looking at the facts that you have, and opening your mind to using these facts as the building blocks for positive and productive self-fulfilling beliefs. The last letter of CAFI is I, which stands for identity. Beliefs form our identity. But I'm not going to dive into this topic quite yet. We've touched on quite a bit of information in this video, clarifying your beliefs, creating positive affirmations, and breaking down limiting beliefs with facts can take a long time. Forming an identity and building beliefs that support identity can take a lifetime. Now, I dive into forming beliefs and identity in a separate video and I hope to post it soon so subscribe and hit that bell icon if you haven't already. Before you start to assess how this part of the CAFI system forms your beliefs, take some time to make sure you have clear goals, form some positive affirmations to repeat throughout the day, and eliminate any negative beliefs by boiling them down to simple objective facts. Now, if you want to dive deeper into how our beliefs create our success, I actually recently spent a few months diving deep into something called the psychology of beliefs, simply because I was trying to help my students in my courses reach more success, and I found that what was limiting a lot of them was just their beliefs. So I started researching and testing and I came up with a system to find your limiting beliefs, pluck them straight from your brain, and give you the tools to control your mindset. If you're interested in the Psychology of Beliefs brain training program, you can check it out for under $20 in the link in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you in the next one.